Hi, I'm Peter Sullivan from Burmad Water Technologies. Today we're going to show you how easy it is to do a drive-by meter reading using the IPL Smart Water Meter. We're going to test different scenarios on the water meters for the IPLs. We're going to have one in a metal enclosure, which is this one here. We're going to close it up. One is going to be submerged into a bucket of water to prove the IP68 and also they can transmit through water in a submerged situation. And then we're going to have the other one that's going to be put into a domestic water meter enclosure cast iron. This is what we're going to test during the test time. To add to the three meters we have downstairs, we've also got other meters in and around the office. So we have one inside the cupboard. We have two others in offices behind the concrete walls to prove that the actual meters can be read through concrete. We'll shut the door and now let's go and test them. All that's required to do a drive-by reading with the iPearl is a magmount aerial, the Census SIRT and a tablet. And the tablet is actually Bluetooth to the unit so it's very easy to use. Okay, so we have eight meters recorded on the system. And they're listed with their locations and their descriptions. As soon as I hit the read all button, the system will start to look for them. So we'll start the drive by after I've hit read all. And then Damien will take the car up to 50 kilometers per hour. We're now at 50. We've acquired the first one. Second one, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All meters acquired. We've acquired the first one. Second one, third, fourth, fifth, six, seven, eight, all meters acquired. Okay, we've come out, we've, we've got all our meters from our routes, we've got them on the, on the tablet, we put the tablet into the docking station, we dock it, and we hit the export button, which takes it into, and we choose the software version we're going to go into, into your billing software. It's as simple as that. Alternatively, we have the handheld device, it can be done the same way, into the docking station, export into the files, into your billing system. It's a very simple system. One of the great things about the iPearl Smart Water Meter is the ability to record extremely low flows. We're currently running about two litres an hour, seen on the drip. As a visual indicator, I'll increase the flow until you see the bar water meter start to work. So currently running at between one and two. We've increased the flow now, slowly increasing the flow with the needle valve. The bar meter has just started to work, so that's the difference. We're going from a stream flow for the bar back to a drip for the eye pearl. So we're now still recording, now we're onto a drip. The eye pearl will come down in its readings now, down to about five. About five, we're down to five now. The bar water meter has now stopped recording. And this is ideal for leak detection. The iPearl is still recording this five. We can get lower. So there you have it. We believe this is a fantastic product. You've seen how easy it is to get the information onto the laptop from the unit. 
We believe this is the best product on the market today and we look forward to doing business with you in the future. Thank you for your time.